Okay, well, we're going to find out how the CK and how the Lone Druid are going to work out uh, for these teams. It is over to OD Pixel and Fog for the first game of Team Secret versus Navi. And being sort of 1v1 by Fada, Suneko will still grab the rune. And in fact, Suneko... Oh, Poppy could have been in some trouble here. Yeah, look at the charge through. They hit off the stun. In they go. Can they control him up? Fada's going to come in and try and hold back Navi. He gets the clap on them. The slow is overwhelming and Jamso rotating now. Yeah, they're looking for potential turnaround. Suneko still trying to finish it. In fact, he gets the the Suneko. Indeed, the Orb of Venom kill does the job. He choo-choo's out of there. He's going to be fine, Suneko. Didn't even need the bash. Getting the big level advantage could be quite devastating to make sure the Tiny always can spam his combo. See what Yap can do about it. A couple of snaps to Roger. Roger. He's level two on Yap, so yeah, I mean, the charge is careful. coming out. They are going to look to try and turn. The smash and the roll coming in onto Roger, but Suneko's there with the save just in time. The bash as well, holding him out for Roger. The neutrals are starting to beat into him, but he'll turn. Yap's going to look to try and deny himself, but he's not going to be a successful as Suneko picks up another kill this action. Uh, good one as well. Yeah, Crystallize and Suneko do have to be careful. Coming in with the remnants, but they will put the phantasm. He gets a couple of delusions out. Now he tries to turn. Chains hold back an illusion. Crystallized pops the stick charges. Now General with the rotation. Avalanche onto two. But Yapsaw's there with the three man combo. He's brought down one. They've taken a second. The Doom's out from Fada and Secret. For mid one to react. Yeah, there's no shaker. There's no sanking. There's no silences oh, either. In top lane. Straight away. I mean, Dendi does get the ultimate out, but the amount of damage coming out from mid one with that flame guard is too much for Dendi on the razor. And secret pick up another bottom lane. Navi trying to get aggressive, but the chain frost bounce is coming out as well as the magnetize. Bring general down low. Ace is also chasing Seneko off to the side of it all. Gets the kill onto the space cow. They do manage to finish oh, off God. general as well. Navi trying to find objectives here as a team, using the phantasm to push down this tier two. Yeah, daytime Cotalags are trying to make something happen. Maybe they could try and find a fight as well. They're up on the high ground, charging onto mid one, but again, no further follow up. Will be blasted to the sidelines, has a remnant out, jumps himself away from the team, and now Yapsaw comes forward. Chain Frost bouncing around as well, but Yapsaw's down. Navi, they find one, they find two. The, the Chain, Chain Frost, Frost still bouncing. Dendi getting done in by the bouncing balls. The root comes out from Ace. Secret will find a second in return. Two for two at the moment. The Doom still taking down Roger. Not quite enough damage. Roger will survive. So Fada's not done yet. Chasing down Crystallize. He'll look to try and toggle his way out of there. With the Avalanche, he may just make it. The Shrine's available. Well, the TP's coming back now. Navi have to be careful about how they choose to go about this. Secret ready to fight. Mid one charging forward with the Remnant. Looking to close in onto Dendi. Dendi able to juke it off to the side. They're, They're right, looking for the look easy the kills. Cardinal. They're trying to get Roger. They want to get that, that man out of the fight, and they will. That's going to be Roger down, secret. Looking for more, but Suneko's out. The rest of them do escape. Only Roger to fall. Mid lane tower will go down to the creeps. And again, Navi. Trying to use the, the advantage of the high ground here. Eyeing up Puppy. They're going to go straight in with the ult, the combo. And whoa, my goodness, Puppy. Miles up in the air, but he gets oh, the, the chance to come with his chain frost. It's just destroying Navi. They've lost two, they've lost three. Dendi to fall as well. Puppy walks it off. And secret, they're not done. Mid one trying to chase. We'll get roared up. But no, the root. It catches out the CK. Crystallizes. He's trying to bring down the bear. He will get the 300 gold, but he's being surrounded slowly and surely by secret. He's trying to man up, but again, the root connects. The silence as well. Mid one keeping himself alive with a slider fist. And they don't just get the CK. They're going to get Roger as well. It's going to be a team wipe secret bringing down every member of Na'Vi it's been scanned out secret hold on the chase Fada's moving in with the shadow blade they've got the sentry down they've got the vision Rosham falling it looks like Na'Vi will be up to secure it though and they do they grab the kill crystallize gets the ages and now straight up they look for Yapsaw uses himself up the chain frost is out as well bouncing around the illusions crystallize trying to bring down puppy but he just can't gets rooted up by ace then he's moving in with the ultimate looking for the bear but the savage roars there pushing Na'Vi back Rune out onto Crystallize. Can they bring him down the once? Does, of course, have that Aegis. Uh-oh, Suneko's in trouble. Stuck by the Ancients. Is he going to get killed by the Ancients, oh, though? Oh, he's going to get killed. He will be denied by the Neutrals, but that is Suneko down for 30. The Aegis also goes down as well. Crystallize does tick down and die, finally. It's about oh, to be nighttime no, now in 50 bottom. seconds. And they Butter. catch Crystallize. He just walks in with the Doom. He does have the backup. Na'Vi are there. They're watching from the sidelines, but they're leaving him from the sidelines. Crystallize will not be getting any help today. Puppy could be in trouble. JK, the Hood of Defiance is up. He just turned Blast down General. Chain Frost as well for the BM as General to fall. Seneko trapped up in the trees as well. Secret again take a fourth.
It's 22 to 5. We're just 27 minutes in. You need to be very careful with his movement. And actually going back through the river, he may have just avoided disaster. I said that Ifada's there looking for the opening and straight up with the Doom. He's ready to go. Root holding back the charge from Soneko. Quickly TP's out of there. Oh. Dendi actually getting kicked by Yapsor. So uh, there'll have to be a bit of an awkward chase, but it looks like it will still be a successful one. Rare mistake by Yapso there. I think he tried to geo, geo pull the stone in and then get the kick, but. I mean, I think that's you know, sort of going back to what you said as well about farming that axe on the corner. Has it really done much for the lineup? Mid lane crystallized, pops the BKB, jump forward as he looks to grab him. Puppy does have the Phantasm charge forward as well. Puppy in trouble. Remnants coming forward. Puppy still alive, trying to walk this one. If he's going to make it as well, Puppy's going to live throughout it all. The boulder smash comes in onto Dendi. Dendi cannot chase Puppy, and melted. Navi lose both of their cores, crystallizing Dendi down for a full minute. That was the fresh BKB usage as well, and he can't kill the Lich during it. Oh man, Puppy. Just gets turned on. They killed that fan those Phantasm Illusions so fast. He's not, he doesn't have the heart yet, you know? It's not those super tanky ones, but either way, at this point, at this deficit, they can kill the Illusions just super easily with the amount of minus armor and just the magic damage. Oh, and look damage. at Yapso. He is starting to dive into the base, just jumping up to the tier fours as such. Forcing back Roger on the Cotterly. We'll get away with the Invisineco. We're going to charge in and cut off the creep wave, but in comes Mib one straight up with the Sly and the Chains. So an echo down once again, and Secret will be able to protect this wave, pushing in on the mid lane. Yeah, he's just he was trying to cut the wave. He doesn't yeah. want them to walk in. Roger now starting the blasts up. They're probably going to look for a quick dive onto Roger as soon as they see him. And they've got the Chains. It's going to be caved up, but the Boulder Smash is on point. They we try and juke it out, but they've got the vision once more. That Shadow Amulet coming to work. He won't be able to avoid the chains, but the Flame Guard's ticking him down. Mid one finishes off with a slight of fist. Crystallizes back, but of course there's no Phantasm. Na'Vi lose the mid racks. Secret killing couriers. This game is this game is impossible for them to come back. Ace is just going to kill all the buildings. They can't take these fights. Coddles their big big power hero. He's dead for 30 seconds. It's it's looking extremely over now. What can they do? How long till the Phantasm? Maybe they're waiting for that. 25 Christmas. seconds. They're but gonna now they're going to tap out anyway. Na'Vi called GG Secret. Absolutely destroying Na'Vi on all fronts here in this game one. I think game two, we can certainly expect Na'Vi to take a, a deep breather and come back with something very different. This lineup just clearly doesn't work. It was very unorthodox kind of draft coming in from the start. I mean, it's a first pick tiny.